Hey everybody, it's Blue Ten and Planks More, Legends of Ocarina of Time Randomizer. Last time, we got quite a few things, I believe, I think, maybe. But this time, we're going to go to the Shadow Temple. And starting off, Big Pose Lead to Little Love. Okay. I think that that means I don't have to be do the Big Pose side quest. I think that means it's just going to give me a recovery heart, so... I'm going to actually mark that off and not go to it unless I absolutely need to. So, where's the thing? Uh, oh, right, it's here. Okay, I'll mark that. Okay, there we go. And I guess that also means I can mark the percentage up as well. So I'll do that. And let's go into the Shadow Temple, because that's what we're doing. Because this, oh no, this music in the Shadow Temple, this just feels like it's mocking me already. But anyway, uh, I only need like two items to actually finish the game now, which is the uh, light arrows and the uh, iron boots, but there's lots of item locations inside the Shadow Temple. So I can probably, by going through the Shadow Temple, get to the last items I need to beat everything in the game and do that. So, it's gonna be somewhat vanilla moving forward, somewhat. There's still gonna be the randomized keys in, inside dungeons, which could complicate things. But most of the game is done now, so we're up to the last quarter. This music, music is good. I can't remember where I last heard it. I'm pretty sure I've heard it somewhere in the game already but I can't remember all right now I remember it was the well the best place ever maybe this place is also gonna be the, one of the best places ever that'd be funny but anyway let's fight dead hand come on come at me don't leave okay Come on! Come on! Finish him? Nope. Ow. Get off me. Also, these aren't hurting me. They're just stunning me. Come on! Let me kill you, thank you. Man, he's creepy. Anyway. <laughs> Moving right along. Let's go get whatever's in this chest. And I forgot to mark the other chest, so let me mark that. The map. Wait, was that? The map was... Oh, vanilla. Okay. Anyway. Dead hand. We get a small key. So there we go. Don't think there's anything else in here. We can move forward. Okay. Man, this music's slightly loud in my ear. I'm going to turn that down. Anyway, let's go to a place of infinite death and destruction, where black holes are and stuff. Speaking of black holes, I just watched a video about the black hole glitch in Super Mario Maker 2, and that is really cool for a glitch. It's probably going to get patched, which is sad because it's so cool. It'd be a great be a great actual feature in the game to be able to stack objects and really just change objects textures to different ones 
but sadly it's a glitch and won't be an actual feature. Now, I'm gonna need to get out bombs to blow up this thing. Da 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 da. Actually, let me just quickly check something. Just making sure I'm not. not checking anything. Okay, I'm good. Ah, uh, but anyway. Let's go to the compass room. And get the compass, because that's definitely what's gonna be here. Okay, there we go. Okay, let me see if I can get this next one as well. There we go. It's nice killing dead, uh, redheads or gibdos in one shot because it means they're just dead. Anyway, let's get whatever this is and it's a piece of heart. I've almost got all of them in the game. Um, now then. So now we can go to the opposite side of this dungeon. Also, this music's gonna get somewhat annoying at the, in, at this rate. Uh, but yeah, I forgot what I was gonna say. Uh, let's get these silver rupees. So we're getting close to the end of the game. I actually, was looking at uh, locations. Oh dear! Slow down! Don't do this to me. I was looking. Oh dear at the last locations left in the game and it appears there's not too many left that we haven't checked. I'm not going to be going to get all of the trading locations probably although I will do what I can. So let's see, where did that open? I think it opened over here. Yes indeed. Let's go ahead and open this. Bomb refills! Yay! And early silver rupee. Except it's multiple, so it's not silver rupee, it's silver rupees. But anyway, let's go back to the main room and continue down through the center. Well, this room's going to get a lot easier. Oh, thanks, Navi, for helping me. Okay, there we go. No one... Why? Oh, dear. I remember this room being really annoying with these sculptors, and I can see why already, but these things... Nev those things that drop down are never usually a problem for me. Except for right now. For some reason. Oh dear. Don't die now! Uh, I wasn't trying to play that, oh well. Oh, there he goes. Goodbye, sir. You will be missed, oh dear. Okay. Well, now that that's done, I can go over here into this room of pain and death and suffering. Oh, Castle is almost done with his Super Mario 64 land. He's just finished the boss as well. That's, I'm probably gonna have to. I'm gonna probably do a let's play of that at some point. Okay, leave me alone. Oh dear. So that will probably be coming after. Actually, I'm not sure when it's when I'm gonna do a let's play of that. It's probably gonna be like after this one and link to the past randomizer. I have a few things I want to do as well. I've got lots of games planned, but I really need to just sit down and record them all and just then I can upload them. And just have them ready. I'm about to run out of videos to actually upload, so. Oh dear. Uh, but it's. It's been doing alright so far. Okay. I believe there's two chests in this room. One. And... Two. Now. Piece of heart. Okay. 
And I guess while I'm here, I'd like to get this because I'd, I'd still like to get all the, the like 50 scuffles. 28. There we go. This track has been really weird with some of the stuff it's just been trying to track. So hopefully it's still correct. Because, yeah, the ocarina keeps changing itself all the time. And I think the magic beans have also been changing themselves. So that's somewhat concerning. Hello, goodbye. Okay. Man, this is gonna be painful. Ow. That works. Man, this place here is especially bad with the... when using... Uh, what they call the hover boots. Because you just get knocked back further because of the slide. But anyway... This music's really not helping right now. There we go. I'm gonna go on the other side now. I thought I those I, th I thought at some point you could just climb up onto the the uh, climb up onto them without having to move the block out of the middle. But apparently that's not actually a thing you can do. You have to actually pull it all the way through, and I'm not sure why. I I, I remember I think I remember actually being able to get up there somehow, but I don't remember it exactly. So it's really weird. But anyway. Oh, I forgot this chest over here. Let me go get that before I forget. Before I baguette. Smokey! Okay, that's good. That'll be very helpful moving forward and actually finishing the dungeon. Especially because the only dungeons left are the ones with uh, um, medallions in them. So I actually need to actually uh, finish all the rest of the dungeons. There's no way to fail them, I think, hopefully. That'd be annoying. Anyway, that's another one. Deku Shield. Okay then. That's a bit random and weird. And let's hit this. To activate the next. Uh, what's it called? Chest. I remember the words. I've played this game before. Haven't I? Anyway. Second chest is. Biggest Bomb Bag. Okay. So I like to mark that and that. There we go. This has been fun. I'm not sure if I'll do more seeds, but I, I probably will. Uh, but probably not right away. I have other things that I need to actually get done. I also need more time to really just record in. Now, I'm going to get up my Lens of Truth. I cannot get onto this platform without it. Even though I think I did in the offline seed, which was somehow... Like, I'm not sure how I actually managed to do that, but I did, so... Oh dear. Make sure I have my, my things on so I don't fall quickly. But anyway, this is the invisible spikes room. And if you have the hover boots, you don't get hurt by the spikes, so that's just great. Die, 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 die. Thank you. I also went through this dungeon completely without the Lens of Truth in the offline seed, so that was fun. Because I couldn't see the actual spikes and I couldn't see whether. Uh, the targets for the hookshot were, which was annoying. But anyway, we're at 80% of the game done now. Let's hit the invisible spikes. Small key, okay. That'll be uh, very useful for finishing up this dungeon, as I've said before about small keys. Now, let's get that one. I'm actually ga glad that these silver rupees actually actually count as rupees. Ah, uh, there we go. Now then, where's there? Does this open? It does open that door. Okay. Oops. Probably should have waited just a little bit longer before taking them off. Now, I believe there's a skulltula back here, or is that future? No, that's here. Get that, there we go, 30 Scottlers. That opens up yet another location, which is good. 
now. I believe there's something else in the skull pot. So I'm gonna have to get that out. Nope. I think I have to also kill the keys to get out of here. If I remember correctly. Just gonna kill those because I don't like them getting in my way. And let's throw the bomb in. I set Link on fire again. He probably doesn't appreciate that, but anyway, Smokey. Okay, so, yeah, I need to kill the other keys. Where is it? Keys. There you are. No, come back, come back, come back. Die, 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 die. Hook shot, hook shot, close shot, long shot, long shot. Please. I know I could just use the bow and it would be faster, but... I want to kill it without having to go into my inventory because... Okay, fine. Oh, dear. Anyway. Guess I'll get the, the bow out if I have to. I'm glad I don't have to do the big Poe quests, hopefully. Oh, come on. Please. There we go. Even though I got two big Poes before even starting it, I still don't want to do it, so... Oh, come on, why did I have to... I, I should have replaced the Din's fire. Wasn't thinking about that at the time, was I? Ow. That wasn't... How did that... That usually doesn't hurt me. So I'm not sure how that hurt me, but anyway. Let's go through here. Now, where am I? Am I at... Oh, dear. I wonder if I can... I can probably get through here without the iron boots, but it's probably a lot harder. And also, I am definitely in that spike trap. Um, what am I meant to do here if I don't have the iron boots? Nope, please don't push me away! Okay, this is actually working somewhat. But the next part of this room is going to be difficult. Uh, like that. Now, where am I? Okay, good. It's not Super Mario 64 or Ocarina of Time. Because in that, if I get thrown into a pit, I go back to the start of it. Fun. Good times. Now, I'm going to go over here here and wait for it to disappear before I jump across. I'm going to have a lot of trouble in this next part of the room though. Okay, there we go. This was meant to be also the wind temple, I believe. Oh dear, how, how and why? Okay, so there's nothing. Oh dear, they perfectly timed as well. Can I shoot that eyeball from here? Can I shoot the eye from here? No, I can't. Okay, I also probably need to be... On! Oh, dear. Maybe... Hover boots? Can help me get across that room? Oh, dear. This is not gonna go well. I was in that spike trap, and I was definitely in that one. Maybe you just don't take damage when you roll. That would be funny. I'm going to wait again for this one. Unfortunately, <laughs> this is quite painful to try and get through without the iron boots. Would not recommend, which is why I'm doing it anyway. Actually, I think I, if I just stand on the edges, I actually don't get blown about by the wind. I actually didn't know about that. Usually, I just have the iron boots by now and just go through. Eyeball. Eyeball. Thank you. Wow, I'm surprised that worked. Now, I need to make sure this is not going when I go past it. Come on. Go away. Go away. Thank you. Okay, so. Uh, I guess. Let's kill these dudes. 
Why is it targeting that? This isn't. This isn't. This isn't. Uh, what's it called? Master Quest. You don't need to shoot that or anything else like it. Anyway, uh, wind hint. Uh, I believe there's a chest right here. There we go. So there we go. There we go. Smoky. Which is good because I needed one before this next room's end. Oh dear. Okay. So there's two in here as well. I'll need my bombs out again. Come on. Come on. My fully upgraded bombs. Which are still the same as they were before, but I hold, have more of them now. Anyway, there's chest number one. Where's, which is the compass. So we have the map and the compass now. I still need the boss key. That's going to be interesting. Uh oh, please, 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 please. Oh, no, what? Oh my goodness, what just happened? This is being a bit weird right now. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. There we go. And I think that spawns the second chest. Yes, it does. So let's open this up. And it was a trap. <sighs> I'm a fool. I'm a fool. Fool. Uh, but anyway, that's it for this episode of Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time Randomizer. Next time, we're probably going to finish up the Shadow Temple and go on to bigger and better things. See you guys then.